Dear viewers of the Tom Photo channel, today I have something for you that I really think might interest you as a photographer. It's a tool I use for my own photography on a daily basis and I believe it could benefit you as well. When I'm out photographing, I have a habit of taking several photos with the same settings because these photos will never be exactly the same. One is always better than the others. Not all are equally sharp, have identical lighting or composition, or come without a mosquito sitting on the lens. To single out the best photo in a series, I need to have all relevant info visible at once. And this is how the Tom Viewer tool was born. It's a photo viewer that allows you to see different views of a photo at once, and you can choose what you want to see. As you flip through your photos, you can immediately delete the ones you don't like and continue flipping until the best ones remain. Here's how it works. Download the tool using the link under the video. It's a Python script that you can place anywhere, but it makes sense to put it in the same folder where your photos are. Now open the terminal, navigate to where you put it, type python3 tom underscore viewer dot py and press enter. Use python instead of python3 for windows. The tool will open, taking up the entire screen to offer a better view of the photo and display the first photo in the folder. You can now click the arrows on the screen or use arrow keys on your keyboard to move back and forth between your images. If you need to change the folder you're looking at, just press the change directory button. As you walk through your images, your full image is shown at the bottom. The top panel shows different views at original size or 100% magnification. The default views are the top left and center of your image. But if you click on the top bar of these cropped images, you can change what part of the photo they're showing. And this will be remembered across all images. You can also create a custom view. This is where the choose buttons come in. For the top left window, press choose one. For the top right window, press choose two. When pressed, they change color, which means you can now select any region in the bottom photo, and it will be blown up in the upper panel for more detailed view. There's no pixel limit. Very small sections will simply go beyond the original size. So if you want to see a specific region at 1000% magnification, you can. If you decide an image isn't good, press delete. For safety, you'll need to press it twice for deletion to take effect. After the first press, the cancel button next to it will light up bright green. If you want to cancel the deletion, just hit cancel and nothing will be deleted. If you accidentally delete the wrong photo, don't worry, it's not permanently deleted. It is simply moved to the trash or recycle bin and can be recovered. The info button summarizes how the tool is used and the exif button does exactly what it says. Here's an example of my most typical use case. I took these photos of an insect on a flower, and I need to find out which one has the insect's eyes the sharpest. The default center view is good for that, but I also like to really zoom in on the insect in the left window. So I click choose one and draw a rectangle around the insect's head. This gives me a very clear view. Then I press the back and forward buttons, or use the keyboard arrows to toggle between neighboring photos of the insect. I go back and forth, looking closely at the eye region to decide which photo in each pair is the sharpest and most appealing. I delete the one I like less. The remaining photo then goes up against the next photo in the series. Again the better one stays. So Tom Viewer makes it convenient for me to choose the best photo and saves me time. I hope you'll find this tool easy to use. Since it's a Python script, it should readily run on Linux, Mac and Windows. If your computer doesn't already have Python for some reason, that can easily be fixed by installing it. This can often be done via the terminal as well if you prefer that route. If the script won't run because Python packages are missing, simply install them. Feel free to stop the video here to take a closer look. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact me via the comments under the video. I'm happy to offer personal assistance. Please also let me know in the comments what you liked or didn't like about the tool and whether you'd like me to change anything. If I make updates in the future, I'll update the text box under the video accordingly. I also invite you to check out my other original photography tools, which correspond to the thumbnails currently displayed.
And if you'd like to support my channel, the best way is to subscribe and like. That directly helps me continue my work. Thank you for your time and please enjoy using Tom Viewer. Goodbye.